You should avoid these nine vegetables if you have diabetes. You're sitting at a family gathering surrounded by the tasty smell of a home-cooked meal as you excitedly wait for your turn to serve yourself. A question pops into your mind, which vegetables should I choose to manage my diabetes effectively? Diabetes is like a tricky puzzle that messes with your body's blood sugar control. When things go wrong, you might have symptoms like being extremely thirsty, needing to use the bathroom a lot, feeling tired, and even unexpectedly losing weight. But don't worry, we're here to explain the veggies you should be careful of the ones that can play tricks on your blood sugar levels. Think of them as sneaky troublemakers that can make your glucose go on a wild roller coaster ride. By avoiding these tricky culprits, you'll be on a smoother path to managing your diabetes. Let's not forget the consequences of this disease. Uncontrolled blood sugar levels can lead to serious health problems like nerve damage, kidney problems, heart issues, and eye disorders. Making informed choices is essential to keep your blood sugar in check and reduce the risk of these complications. Today we start a journey to discover the truth backed by scientific studies, about which vegetables you should avoid if you have diabetes. So grab a seat and join us as we dive into the fascinating world of vegetable choices for those with diabetes. 1. Corn. Corn is a popular ingredient in many meals, but it's not suitable for people diagnosed with diabetes, even in small amounts. Eating just one cup of corn can introduce about 21 carbohydrates to your body which can negatively impact your blood sugar levels. Furthermore, corn contains glucose, which makes the effects on your blood sugar even worse. Similarly, corn syrup derived from this vegetable should be avoided since it poses the same risks. 2. Potatoes. Potatoes are a no-go for folks with diabetes. They're packed with starch and carbs that can send your blood sugar on a wild ride, with a very high glycemic index of 86 per 100 grams, these spuds are a big, no thanks, if you're watching your blood sugar. Baked, fried, boiled, or roasted it doesn't matter, their impact remains the same. So let's give potatoes a break and explore other veggie options that work better with diabetes management. Trust me, your blood sugar will thank you. 3. Green Peas Green peas do offer some great nutrients, but unfortunately they are not the best choice for people with diabetes. It all comes down to their high carbohydrate content. You see, eating too many peas can cause a buildup of carbs in your system, and that's a recipe for soaring blood sugar levels. We want to avoid that roller coaster ride. While peas may be tasty, it's important to be mindful of their impact on blood sugar if you have diabetes. 4. Butternut squash. It's packed with nutrients and fiber which are great for overall health. However, when it comes to managing blood sugar, butternut squash might not be your best buddy. This colorful veggie is quite high in carbs, and eating it can mess up your efforts to check your blood sugar levels. It's like a troublesome roadblock on your journey to stability. So if you're dealing with fluctuating blood sugar issues, Avoiding this particular vegetable is a good idea, its potential downsides outweigh its benefits in such cases. 5. Yam. These root vegetables may seem tempting, but if you're watching your blood sugar levels, it's important to understand why. You see, yams are quite high in carbs, and the glycemic load of 3 quarters cup of yam is about 29. That number indicates that eating this amount of yam can have a big impact on your blood sugar levels. Yams belong to the starchy vegetable category, and they contain simple carbs. These simple carbs have a tendency to quickly enter the bloodstream, which can cause your blood sugar levels to skyrocket. We want to avoid that sudden surge. 6. Celery. You might think celery is a safe choice with its low calories, low carbs, and high water content. However, it's not just about what celery contains how it's grown and transported that makes all the difference. Being a tall growing vegetable, celery is more susceptible to the effects of pesticides throughout its journey from farm to your plate. It often becomes laden with harmful chemicals and pesticides, and that's where the danger lies especially for those with diabetes and lower immunity. 
Consuming such pesticide-laden food can potentially lead to various health disorders. 7. Broad bean. Let's talk about another member of the bean family broad beans, also known as fava beans. These beans may be tasty, but they come with some factors to consider, especially if you have diabetes. They pack quite a punch when it comes to calories and carbs. Most of the carbohydrate content in broad beans is sugar, just one cup of these beans contains around 12 grams of sugar. Now that amount can be troublesome for people with diabetes who need to watch their blood sugar levels. It's like having a sweet surprise that can throw things off balance. Not only that, broad beans are also relatively high in calories, a single cup of broad beans accounts for approximately 111 calories. For those watching their weight and overall health, keeping tabs on calorie intake is essential. 8. Pickled Vegetables Let's dive into a topic that sheds light on the importance of mindful choices, especially when dealing with a lifestyle disorder. You see, not all vegetables are automatically healthy, and one particular preparation method can be a concern pickled vegetables. An interesting process where vegetables are soaked in high amounts of sodium for an extended period. During pickling, the excessive use of salt and vinegar can have negative impacts, particularly on blood pressure. For people with diabetes who are already at higher risk for heart diseases, consuming too much sodium can make the situation worse. 9. Packaged Vegetable Juice While they may seem like a convenient substitute for fresh vegetables, it's important to understand the potential downsides, especially if you have diabetes. Beware of store-bought options, whether bottled carrot juice, tomato juice, bitter gourd juice, or any other variety. These packaged juices often contain high sugar, chemicals, and preservatives that can take away the nutritional value you're seeking. Unfortunately, these additives can mess with your blood sugar levels and even invite various health disorders due to the product's contents. It's essential to be mindful of your vegetable choices if you have diabetes. Summary. While these nine vegetables may have their nutritional benefits, they also come with potential downsides that can impact blood sugar levels and overall health. However, it's important to note that moderation and portion control can still allow for the occasional inclusion of these vegetables in your diet small portions or enjoying them on special occasions can be considered. It's always a good idea to talk to a healthcare professional or registered dietitian for some personalized advice that suits your specific health needs.